Albany's long-term financial planning committee is thinking long-term when it comes to bringing jobs to the area. The committee unanimously approved the standards companies will have to meet in order to qualify for MEAG assistance. One third of this fund, fund is going to uh, be used to, as incentives to help attract new industry to Albany. The whole purpose is to create uh, new jobs and, and attract capital investment to the area. If passed by the city commission, the guidelines will determine how much each company is awarded and how the funds should be used. For example, if a company creates 100 jobs, that could warrant up to $200,000 in grant funds. While officials are utilizing Albany's job investment funds to boost employment in the area, they also want to make sure the $11 million pot of cash doesn't run dry. We need a guideline on how we're going to be able to get the money back, what we're going to be doing with it because it will be millions of dollars. Albany economic development officials are now working on a plan of how to keep money streaming into the MEAC fund. They are going to negotiate the process and sort of build up the guidelines that we need to take to the entire commission about bringing jobs in and trying to increase jobs and make some factors of companies move to Albany. Commissioner Tommy Postel says when money is placed back into the fund, it'll allow the city of Albany to attract even more businesses which is a win-win situation for the businesses, the city, and the community. Jessica Fairley, Fox 31 News.